What's up guys, it's Sonic, and today we're going to be talking about trophy pushing. That's something I'm doing right now. Yesterday I was in Gold 3, today I'm in Crystal 2. Really haven't been doing a whole lot except Clash of Clans. That's okay. So as you see, no free builders. Really, when a lot of people think that when you're trophy pushing, you're not going to be getting a lot of loot, which is sometimes true. If you really care about trophies, you'll attack a base that's easy, even if it doesn't have a lot of loot. But you still can make a lot of good loot. I mean, look at this. I have no free builders. That's how much stuff I've been having go on. And I'll just show you guys what I've been doing, which what I feel lately has been a great trophy push. And when the Hog Rider event was out, that was about as good as it gets. Made just 44 Hog Riders. They just absolutely tore stuff up. Had a couple heal spells. It was basically unstoppable. But we'll take a look at the attack log. And this is what I've been using since my Dark Barracks started upgrading. Because I really don't feel like waiting for the minions. But before this, I was going Lalunian. That's balloons, or just Lunian. Balloons and minions with my heroes. Two heals, two rage. And look at this loot. Just look at the good, not a whole lot of dark there. Like, pretty good loot, pretty good loot. Look at that, it's real good loot. And then, once my Dark Bear started upgrading, I started using, instead of 35 minions, I had 50 archers and 20 barbs. And still been doing, look at this, great loot here, okay loot here, great loot, good loot, really not, oh, great loot right here. Uh, we'll take a look at this replay, I've got 17 trophies. So we're just looking at a base that's really not hard. I see that this air sweeper could cause me some trouble if I attack up this way, so obviously we're just not going to do that. So the raid gets started. Tried to get the lure with those barbs, didn't do it. So I just send in some barbs here because I know I want my queen to take out this air sweeper right here. So everything just kind of starts coming down. We got some people in the corner so we can get those trophies as well. Queen comes down, she's going to start doing her thing, and I see some giants coming out of this clan castle. Not worried at all, considering I'm attacking with balloons, and I know my archer, and my king bar, if I need him, can easily take out those troops. So here comes the balloon parade. Everybody loves a good balloon parade. They start coming down. I got two heals, two rages, they'll go right about here, I believe. There's one, there's two, and they just start just running amok, just absolutely destroying this base. Those air bombs did do some good damage to us, but as you can see, it's just, it's just not enough. A nice Town Hall 8 base right here that I'm just absolutely taking care of. Still, I, just, I saved these 29 archers. You know, if I'm going to be efficient, why, why waste them? Might as well, you know, do some extra attacking, save a little bit of time. So here we go, got my heroes. Got, you know, the few cleanup troops that survived. They're just kind of doing their thing. And these balloons, just... Look, look at the loot, guys. Look at that loot. You see, they just destroy the base. Look at that loot. This army costs 275,000 elixir. It's kind of a lot, I'm going to be honest. But it's super quick. You're not going to find a quicker trophy-pushing army to make. And look at this. Over 300k of elixir, so I'm making that. 300k of gold, 1800 dark elixir. Guys, that's good stuff when you're trophy pushing. And look how far I've trophy pushed. Like, really? I'm in Crystal 2 right now. And I'm... Oh, we have a full army camp. Let's, uh, get a little live attack going. Gotta collect my stuff. As you guys can see, I'm just really making a big push right now to get my base to a real good level. Clan War's over. Uh, we lost. Not a huge surprise there, a little upset. Um, clan just really hasn't been performing lately. But, you know, we'll get into that in another video. So, here we go. I'll send out a little request. See if I can get anything. Do I have anything here? Oh, I do have some troops. So, we'll just kind of get on with the attack. Here we go. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what kind of damage we can cause. Um, so just kind of, when you're looking for trophy bases, at least for me, um, this one does not have enough loot for me to attack, 
don't even know if I'd want to attack this one anyways, because you're not going with your best army, you're going with a very decent army. Um, this one, if you don't care about Elixir, and you only care about, like, a little bit of Dark and the trophies, you could take this one. Not Gunner, I'm so you can see if I can find something a little bit better. Um, some okay loot here, still. I wish we could get a little bit more. Um, eventually you just gotta pick one. Sometimes you're gonna lose loot. That's just how it's gonna be. So if you're gonna, if you know you're gonna be losing loot on attack, make sure you at least get like at least 20 trophies for it. All right, here we go. Very, very little loot. 32 trophies. Do we go for it? No, that's that's that's. I can't even believe how little loot that is. I wouldn't have enough to make my next army. All right, this is it. 22 trophies. A good amount of loot up here. Um. Not very high air defenses, I can tell you right now, we can take out that one with some barge troops, take out that sweeper, um, take out this queen, and that's exactly how we're going to start this bad boy off. King's going to go down. Um, I am attacking from my computer right now, I'm usually attacking from a phone, so this is going to be a little bit different for me, but um, we'll see how it works. Uh, it's a little laggy, but we'll see how we can get things done. No excuses here. We're going to battle on. Take care of these builder's huts. We don't want those just kind of sticking around. Doing a whole lot of nothing for us. Or just, you know, they'll get distracted by that builder's hut. That's cool. I really want this air sweeper taken out, so that's what we're going to do. And now, uh, I'm going to send in archers to have this bomb tower. I don't really want my balloons to have to deal with it. And here comes the balloon parade. Here we go. Just a nice big line. Let them do their thing, man. They're relatively smart. They can do it. We're going to get a heal here. A heal here in case any decide to path that way. And a couple do. So we're going to get that heal going. I want those air defenses taken out real quick. So we're going to get a rage there. And, okay. Uh, please go towards the air defenses. Or not. Rage there. Now all the air defenses are taken out. Uh, there's obviously nothing in the CC. I'm going to place my Archer Queen up here. Do a little bit of cleanup. And this raid's looking pretty good. Um, we're gonna, we should be getting the three stars from here, barring any, uh, you know, disasters. Speed up this process a little bit, get some my archers down there. There we go, last Tesla. Boom, down it goes. So now it's just cleaned up mode. We got a minute and 20 seconds. That's plenty of time. Uh, especially because, you know, these air troops, that king, he's going to kill those archers. Not a big deal. Got the balloons coming in. Archers kind of doing their thing up here. And uh, got some good loot. No free builders, so you can't do anything with said loot. But hey, it's always nice to have it for when those builders are free. Go, just going to pop her ability. Just kind of speed things up. Absolutely walloped this base, people. Absolutely walloped it. So, 22 more trophies. Not bad. Trying to push the champions. Never been there before. So, we'll see how this goes. Hopefully, you know, we just get things done. Start killing it. Look at that, guys. That's good loot right there. I'll take that. Not a whole lot of dark, but you know what? That's alright. Didn't spend any. Got a nice poison spell. Welcome this new person to the clan. Always got to be courteous to the clan mates, you know? So let's go to the quick train. Boom. Got things going. Look at this. It only takes 22 minutes. That's real freaking quick. Uh, as you guys can see my tr quick train, I just have whatever trophy pushing army I'm using at the moment. Then I have my Goho, got the Laloon. And so, um, really I've just been more focused on the ground attacks. My last three ground attacks in war have been, uh, three stars. So, uh, whenever I use air, things just don't seem to go my way. So, uh, yeah, it's basically the trophy pushing. That's pretty much what you're looking at right there. That's what I've been doing. Just those uh, barge troops really getting stuff done. Uh, good loot. Good 
loot. Let's loot this replay. Got a lot of good loot there. Alright, this base, a little bit harder than the one I just attacked. But, really not too worried. I think I can get it done. I see those air defenses aren't really high leveled. So I just kind of start my thing. Get the balloons going. Nice big balloon parade. And I see once that uh, Archer Queen hops over that wall, immediately send my King Barb. Doesn't have to break through walls. Easily kills her. Not a big deal. Um, another thing about when you're trophy pushing like this, you're not really worried about the clan castle. You just kind of kind of hope nothing's in there. And if something is, take it out on the fly. Um, that's what you get your uh, Archer Queen for. So as you see, we've used three of our spells already. Pop the heal right over here. Not weird at all. So many balloons. Look at that. That's just that's overkill right there, people. Absolutely destroying it. Speed things up a little bit. They just keep on moving. Really nothing to worry about. Archer Queen comes down. Pops her ability. Takes care of the king. Uh, then the balloons go down. And I was actually... Oh, yeah. This is the raid I got real worried by. Uh, the balloons go down. Still had three point defenses up. Barbs. Group of little barbs. Just come on in. Take them out. Who says barbs aren't any good? I know I don't. So uh, then just got this cannon left. I know all the cleanups being taken care of by these archers. But this cannon could prove trouble. But I got a level 11 archer queen at half health. So I'm not worried. She takes it out. Everything's still going good. Uh, look at this loot, guys. Look at that loot. That's that's good loot right there. No doubt about it. Um, you know, we just kind of bust through that wall. Here we go. Head towards the town hall, the clan castle. Boom. Whip, bam, boom. Done. Takes it all out. And stick a fork in this base, people. It's done. Just rated it for everything it had. 22 trophies, tons of loot, super simple army. Doesn't get a whole lot simpler than that. Um, oh, got some troops to Clan Castle. Oh, wait, I already knew that. So that's basically it when it comes to my trophy pushing army. Uh, it's going real well. When my Dark Barracks is finished upgrading, I don't know if I'm going to go back to using the loons or the minions. I might. Um, things were going pretty well with them, too. Can't deny that. Uh, was getting some good loot. Not great loot. As you guys can see, it's pretty good loot here. Um, same thing really with them. You place the line of balloons down. You place the minions up behind them. You know, we'll take a look at one real quick. Just so you guys can see kind of what's going on. Uh, lots of loot here to be had. So immediately, looked for a lure. Nothing. Takes out these heroes. Uh, got my Archer Queen taking care of that Sweeper up in here, so that way I can attack from this way. The Sweeper won't bother me. She's going, she's going, she's taking some fire. Heads towards that army camp. Pop the ability, boom, down goes the Air Sweeper. Uh, here comes a line of balloons. See this Air Sweeper? Can't touch us. Um, we're doing pretty well. Then the minions, just like the Archers and the other army and the Barbs, just come down in a wall right behind the balloons. Uh, in this attack, my balloons did perfectly, just a nice big split, get the spells going, just plow them towards the center, towards the core. Um, real, real good stuff. Real just domination on this base. Look at that going. Bam. Lots of balloons. Just forget about it. Just absolutely taking care of business. So we got a ton of balloons. Minions come in. Great thing about using the minions when you're trophy pushing compared to the barbs and archers is those flying skeleton traps can prove to be a little annoying, but those minions just come in, take care of business, and uh, everything goes well. The only thing with that, you're spending not a lot, only 300 dark elixir, but if you want to just save a little bit of dark elixir per raid, then you can switch those out with the barge troops. Or if you want to speed up the training time by a few minutes, you could also do that. Um, so that's basically what I'm doing right now for trophy pushing. I'm in Crystal 2, um, definitely going to try to just push to Champions League, get in there, kind of see how I'm swinging with those guys up there, maybe practice some good war strategies, um, uh, so yeah, we'll see how that goes, uh, thanks for watching, this is Sonic signing off, uh, thank you.